This banner means we are officially at the end of NHL 22, which means I can officially show off the end game squad I put together with no money spent. What's going on, guys? Thrash here. We're going to go through my team. We're going to go through my stats. A lot of people have been asking me about my team. I haven't showed it off in a little bit, and it is pretty damn good for no money spent, I would say so. So starting off with 99 Alexander Ovechkin, this is one of the cards I built. Uh, it's pretty easy to build cards this year. I think they did a really good job of making it uh, free-to-play friendly. And hopefully next year is even easier so more people can uh, find teams like this. So we have Ovi at 99. Austin Matthews, I actually pulled this card, which is absolutely unreal. So amazing card to have, of course. And then Kirill Kaprizov, I actually pulled this card as well. Played 331 games with him. Matthews played 550. So I had these guys on the team for a long time. I was able to get a lot of games in with them. Fun fact, I actually didn't even finish all of the Rivals games. I didn't play 500 Rivals games this year. So that being said, I have all these cards and all of this, no money spent, and I didn't play all my objectives. So I think I did a pretty good job. Uh, second line, we have Joe Pavelski. Believe it or not, I pulled him too. <laughs> a lot of this team is cards that I built, and a lot of this team is cards that I pulled. So uh, Joe Pavelski here. Jonathan Taze, I built him, and I had to build Taze. Taze is always... Such an amazing build every single year. And we have Connor McDavid, obviously, X-Factor. Uh, I pulled him, but built him. Third line, we got Troy Terry. He's very new. I just pulled him, I think, last week or the week before. 28 games with him. He had 11 points. Can't say too much about him. I didn't play with him that much. Uh, most of them were champs games. I think all of them were champs games, honestly. But regardless, I mean, it's another card, 99. Then we have Brock Nelson. Pulled him as well, 99 overall. He was actually really good. Uh, one of the better cards I used uh, on my third line center, he's been third line center the entire time for uh, 168 games. He was very good. So if you guys are looking for a good card next year, Brock Nelson could be a great choice. And Jonathan Huberto, I got him out of the best of the rest or the team of season pack, I think. I think. Don't quote me. We got Mario Lemieux. Of course, I recently built him 28 games, only four points. He was on the fourth line. Uh, my fourth line didn't see a lot of time in general, as you're going to see with Ryan O'Reilly, who I pulled. Yeah, I pulled him as well. Uh, 160-something points in 484 games. Again, didn't get a lot of playing time. And last but not least, Brady Kachuk, who, guess what? I pulled him as well. I pulled a lot of cards on this uh, on this account. Uh, I got very lucky this year. So this is my no-money-spent forward group right here. All 99s pretty much, except for a couple of cards here and a couple of cards there. So pretty solid. On defense, we've got Victor Hedman, 99, who I pulled. <laughs> Uh, 383 games. I pulled him back in June. We got Moritz Sider, who, of course, I had to build immediately. As soon as he was announced, I had to build this card. One of my favorite players. He won the Calder, and I can't wait to see what he does for Detroit in the upcoming future. And I can't wait to see what his base card is in NHL 23. We've got Devon Taze, who I pulled two weeks ago. 99 MSP. Uh, at this point in the year, in it is September 7th, I pulled him. At this point in the year, everyone has a 99. Every card that's out is a 99. So if you pull a special card, you're pulling a 99. So that's why a lot of these cards are so high overall. Uh, Tyler Myers, this is the free card I got from finishing the objectives. So I got him finished way back in July. He played 253 games for me. Olimata, I built him in May before he was a wing. And then it turned out that he was going to be a wing. And I was very happy with this. So Olimata at 98. And Adam Fox, who I'm pretty sure I got out of a team of the season pack. I pulled a Gretzky earlier in the year. I pulled a Wayne Gretzky earlier in the year. Sold for like 1.7 million. That led to me being able to open a lot of different packs and do a lot of different things, which allowed me to get this Adam Fox and a couple other Team of the Season cards. Last but not least, we got Darcy Kemper. He went 302 and 33 for me and 335 games since June 29th. Pretty damn good goalie. Uh, stats aren't amazing, but he got the Ws and that's all that really mattered. I pulled him as well in case people were wondering. Now, for synergies, I used Distributor, Workhorse, Thief, Buzzing, Bombarded, Fly the Zone, Gladiator, Wingman, Spark, Booming Shot, and that is it. For my abilities, they just upped the abilities. I didn't really get to play with them up, upping the abilities too much, but uh, I don't really think it matters too much. A lot of it was tape to tape, and a lot of it was like no contest, and whatever was going to help me get control of the puck. My final record on my no money spent team, my free to play team is 867, 293, and 20, with 485 of them being Rivals games, so the other half being all champs games. I played a lot of champs this year on this account. Uh, Rivals games, I played 486. I didn't finish them, and I'm not going to finish them. I'm not playing any more games this year. So, I mean, if I play 14 more games, I get an Ultimate Pack and then Jumbo Elite Pack. I'm not doing it. I just, I can't. I'm, I'm taking a couple weeks off and getting ready for NHL 23. So, that is the record. That is, you know, all my stats here. We can go through my team and whatnot. But uh, the collection is pretty much empty. I'm actually going to be trading in every single one of these players and uh, we're going to open up 32 different theme team packs, and that's going to be a lot of fun as well. 
So I look at Ovi, over a point per game. Such a good card. Kaprizov, point per game. Headman on defense, 304 and 383. That's absolutely amazing. Like, th this is a really good team. I had a lot of fun playing with them this year. Uh, Pavelski did great on the second line. Like, I'm very happy with how the team played this year. Uh, I can't wait to do this again. Next year, I'll have multiple teams again. I'll have a free-to-play team and a pay-to-win team and a couple different series I'm going to be bringing to you guys as well. So very excited for that. But that is my free-to-play team, my no-money-spent team. This is the end of my team. I'm going to be trading everyone in for theme team packs. Just to have fun, we're going to open up one from every team. Now, I am going to do one last pack opening on Wednesday. I'm going to have all my Rivals and Champs rewards for my two accounts. So make sure you come stop by and hang out for that. But regardless, that is going to do it for this video. I appreciate you guys checking it out. Goodbye, NHL 22 on the free-to-play team. The next time you see this, all these players will be gone. And we'll be opening up one of every 32 teams theme team pack. I cannot wait for that. That's going to be a lot of fun. wonder how many 99s I'll pull, if any. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Wonderful year, and thank you for everything. Stay frosty.